Hi, I'm Mark Donovan from HomeEditionPlus.com, and today I'm installing a new composite deck railing system from Fiberon. Um, for the next uh, few minutes, I'll show you how to install a section of rail system uh, between two posts. So the first step in any deck railing system is to make sure your 4x4 pressure treated posts are perfectly straight and plumb. So use a level to do that. So next we're going to take one of our post leaves and cut it to approximately 1 to 2 inches higher than the uh, height of the uh, 4x4 post. Um, you want to have the same exact height on all your post leaves uh, relative to the surface of the deck. We then simply slide the post sleeve over the 4x4 post and then slide the skirt over the 4x4 post and we're ready to begin the actual installation of the railing system. So next what I've done is I've laid the top railing post on top of the uh, post leaves and made sure that the spacing between the outer post and the sleeve is the same on both sides, opposite sides of the railing. In this case it's about one and a half inches between the sleeve and the center of this post. Now we're going to go and trim the, uh, the top rail piece on both sides and then we'll slide in here and wound up screwing it into place onto the uh, post leaves. So now we're taking the top rail that we just cut and lining up with the bottom rail and also lining up the center of the baluster holes um, with each other and then we're simply going to mark with a pencil on either side of the bottom piece where we need to make our cuts there so we have a nice uh, even width uh, rail section between the top and the bottom. So now I'm mounting the brackets to the uh, top rail post and we'll mount the uh, bracket again right at the end approximately 1 16th in from the edge of the outer lip of the uh, top rail. So now I'm popping in the baluster inserts along the length of the rail system. You can put either a, a straight insert or you can turn it about 22 degrees to have a diamond look for your balusters. Now I'm fastening down a bracket for a center support post for the bottom rail piece. So now I'm fastening the uh, bottom rail to the uh, post. Now we're just installing the balusters in the post. Now I've just placed the top railing section onto the balusters and just kind of pushing it down to lock them in place. So I've drilled some pilot holes into the post leaves and now just um, fastening in the rail system into the uh, post. So all that's left here is to put on the uh, top cap on the post, we'll glue it down with some PVC glue and this project's done. If you have other home improvement questions, visit us at homeeditionplus.com today.